Hi guys, I'm Sean. This is Alyssa. Gus is in our hearts, and, and this, this is in our road hole daily. Yeah. And we are back hanging out on the subreddit. That's mm -hmm. right, guys. We're checking out some videos that you guys have requested that many of you have upvoted, and we just haven't had a chance yet to check them out. And so uh, this one right here is was posted by Sonus Wheaty two months ago. <laughs> I know we're a little bit behind here, guys, but it says you will like this one. <laughs> and the uh, name of the video is Stand Up Comedy White People Problems. So I'm very curious to see what this I is know, all, yeah. all about. As a white person, I certainly have my uh, fair share of problems. So I think I'm going to relate to this one. But uh, anyways, we'll get into this one. It looks like a lot of fun. It says NRIs, Indian Americans and white people. Now, mm -hmm. I'm not sure what NRI stands for. So hopefully mm -hmm. that's sort of clarified. Maybe we'll look real quickly here, actually. Forward. Oh, it seems like something to do with an Indian passport. Non-resident non of India. Non-resident Indian. Okay. Oh, right. okay. So now we get what that's all about. Yes. So we can uh, watch it with a little bit more context there. Okay. Oh, I guess. Oh, sorry. I thought we already had that one open. I guess not. So we'll just click on it. Oh. Okay. I'll click. Oh, I'm clicking. There it is. There it is. This guy's all over the place. Wow. So technically the name is NRI's Indian Americans and white people problem. Oh, Kenny Sebastian. We've watched Kenny Sebastian before. We haven't watched this one though, right? So it's not just white people. Yeah, yeah. It's also so people that aren't oh, like and white people. So people problems. that aren't like yeah, yeah. native Indians, right? Yeah. Or, or or people who aren't both white people and people from India who are living in the West. So uh let's uh you know see what what he mm -hmm. has to say. I did some open mics, uh, some open mic comedy nights in in New York, and it's great because all the white comics love to complain. Ah! <laughs> white people complaining is amazing. <laughs> oh, I just can't get it out of my head. When I said native Indians, I had I was not associated at all with like Aboriginal people. Oh. I just meant people native to in, like, as in like they were born and raised there. Yeah, yeah, we know what you're like talking about. Raised. No, but in Canada, it's yeah. very much like people used to call Aboriginal people native Indian because when Columbus landed here, you he thought. thought he was in India. Uh, I know. So I meant like they are, um, they grew, were born and raised in All right. India. Sorry, let's just rewind. I just can't get it out of my head because I just wanted to clear that up. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, this guy's everywhere. East Coast, West Coast, all over America doing this thing. Plays the guitar. That seems like fun. Maybe he's got some comedic some songs. Mics, uh, some open mic comedy nights in, in New York, and it's great because all the white comics love to complain. Mm. <laughs> white people complaining is amazing. <laughs> it's because India has, whoa, we have problems, but we have a very high standard. Yeah, yeah, problems. totally. <laughs> it's a very high standard. <laughs> then it qualifies as a problem. Because in India, like, oh, you have a cold? Wait for one day, it'll go. <laughs> or you fractured your leg, wait for one month, don't move it. <laughs> it will be fine. Hey, where's this boy's head? What happened? Car accident though. Oh no. Is the car okay? <laughs> oh no. <laughs> that's, that's when it's a problem, when the head is missing, that's the serious problem. <laughs> America is awesome. I think I think there's pollen here. I'm allergic to pollen. Yeah, yeah, totally. That's me. Yeah. It's like if we don't I get the right drink allergies. from Starbucks, it's like the end of the day. Oh, they've put in uh, you know, actual milk instead of soy milk. My life is over. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> pollen. Like gotta get my medication. Yeah, yeah. So I went for the open mics and they're like complaining, they're like, you know. Too much population in New York. Ah. <laughs> too many people. <laughs> Talking to an Indian saying this. Yeah. Too many people? In India, there's so many people around you that sometimes when you're walking, you don't know if you're moving. <laughs> <laughs> it's just that everyone's moving around. There's a situation where the train the other train Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. We've all had that happen, <laughs> in a car particularly. Thank you guys. Thank you. I was getting a clap through. Is that what they call that right, in yeah, comedy yeah. world? Okay. <laughs> right. get you, man. <laughs> it's just like. <laughs> okay, so let's just have to get a pool from the white guy. <laughs> working on this. So how many, how many first generation Indians here like to just move from India? Yeah. 
Oh, sweet. And only second generation, like, parents moved here. Second generation? Yeah, so when? Sorry? Just you? What's your name? Jyoti. Jyoti? What the fuck? You name, pronounce your name correctly? <laughs> <laughs> You're not second generation. Jody. Usually be like Jody, yeah, or something. Yeah. Like a Western name. But if you're second generation, doesn't mean you don't like speak um, either like Hindi or Punjabi or whatever, like to your family. Like no. that's probably still your native, your first language would be. Well, I, I think what he's sort of poking the joke at here is that a lot of uh, Indian, Americans, Canadians, they'll have a yeah. name like um, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gurpreet or something, but then they'll just shorten it to Gary yeah, or, yeah, yeah. you know, something like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Do you think the question is white guys or black, uh, brown guys? <laughs> That's my question. Uh, brown guy? Yeah. Did family put a gun to your head and make it? <laughs> <laughs> Genuinely, you wanted to. Yeah? Yeah, it's very, it's very. Uh, so in India, when we are in a club and try to pick up chicks, because guy, Indian guys are great at picking up chicks. <laughs> 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 That's not the stereotype necessarily that we have here in the world. Yeah, I think he's being really sarcastic. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I missed all the women are clapping. <laughs> <laughs> all the women are clapping. All the guys are like, he's not talking about me, bro. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's already very difficult okay, being, being an Indian guy. Indian women here look, anyway, they look amazing in India. Here they look even more hot. Uh -huh. They look worse. Ah. Uh -huh. <laughs> I don't know how they manage that, which makes me feel good. Because when I'm in New York, surrounded by such amazingly fit, beautiful white people, I see another ugly Indian, I'm like, oh, thank God. <laughs> 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 oh, that's so bad. I don't want to be the only ugly guy here. He's not <laughs> ugly, he's <laughs> like <laughs> really <laughs> handsome. Yeah, yeah, you're, you're Are you guys dating? Okay, we just got married a few months ago. You just got married a few months ago, yeah. wow. Did you guys meet here? Yeah, we met in New York. Met in New York. You guys been living here for a while? Yeah. Yeah, how long? Four for her, five for me. Four. You've, you've been here for four years, and you've been here for five years. You have to catch up on the accent, buddy. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> like, four years, five years, and you're like, four years, five years. <laughs> <laughs> He's really good at the, uh, what is it called? The crowd play or what yeah, do they call it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, audience. the uh, audience interaction yeah, or, yeah. or crowd play or what have you. You have to roll your ass, bro. <laughs> <laughs> you have to get, oh, but do you have the, do you switch? Do you do the switch from? talking to each other in Indian English accent, and then the waiter comes like, I would like a grape. <laughs> <laughs> like a water, grape. Yeah, so anyway, I was like, bro, what are you doing? <laughs> I love watching that switch. <laughs> <laughs> switch. Uh, that's funny. It is great. Do you do that? Do you have the switch pad down yet? She just orders and I get the grape. Oh, she does that. Uh, so you have the switch ready. Yeah, can, yeah. You, can you order something? I don't know the Canadian accent. And they, and oh, wow, you, you heard the, the Canadian accent, accent there. Oh, sweet. Yeah. She's ready for backup. Yeah. In, case. <laughs> in case it doesn't work out. White guy, Canadian, American, I can manage. <laughs> but very nice. You guys got married. Very nice. You got married here? Delhi, Bombay, Kuwait. Too many events. Wow. <laughs> what? <laughs> That's like, like an Indian family because you gotta like, have like different ceremonies and different spots and all that. So stuff. it was like literally multiple like wedding events. Like it's almost like three or four different weddings they had. Yeah, it sounds like it. Oh my god, that would be like way too much for me. Yeah, I, I, or way too much fun. Oh, mm, I mean, yeah. <laughs> you want to have absolutely no wedding? You no. want to just like go down to the like courthouse and like sign papers? No, I told you I want to go you down to India and have a wedding with all these guys. Invite okay. all the IRH family. Either you guys are super rich. My family's from Delhi, my family's from Bombay, and Kuwait was on the way. So. <laughs> <laughs> Might, as well. Might as well. Might as well get married there. Oh, I wish that was longer. I know. They've given you a little taste of oh. it, right? Wow. He's well, it looks so like funny. we got some other videos to check out. He's like my favorite so far, I think, of the comedians we've seen. I oh, really liked it. Right on. Um, can we watch more of his videos? We can, but we've got a few more recommendations from the uh, subreddit to come up first. But you okay. know what? There might be a few people who feel strongly like you do that we need to check out some more Kenny Sebastian. Yeah. And if you are one of those people, well, then we're going to ask you to click that subscribe button. Click the little bell icon. Choose all from the drop down menu so you can get updated every, every time, time I upload a new video. video. If you enjoyed this video, please let us know by clicking the thumbs up button and leaving thoughts in the comments down below. You can send in recommendations to our email, iratesubtitles.gmail.com mm -hmm. or the subreddit 
which is where we got this one. And, you know, you can upvote on there which ones you want us to see. So it just sort of lets us know what yeah. is popping. That's right. And in fact, a few of you upvoted this one and it put it on our radar. And so we mm -hmm. had to check it out. And if you want to support the channel in other ways, we do have some donation links down there, guys. Uh, it takes time and money to put this stuff together. We love doing it. But if we've got more money, we got more time and we can do more of this stuff with you guys. We love you a whole lot. This love is Internet Rabbit Hole Daily. IRA, signing off. Bye. Bye-bye, guys.